all the things I've seen on the battlefields of the frontier, the pilot is the true dominant force. Fast and agile. Graceful, yet devastating. Perceptive. Resourceful. And relentless. A pilot sees the world differently. Sheer walls become flanking routes. Pilots fight differently. Experienced in deception and maneuver, even overwhelming odds shift in their favor. But what truly separates the pilot from all the grunts and machines of the battlefield is the bond between a pilot and a titan. can only be stopped by overwhelming force, or an equal. The frontier has been the only home I've ever known. For years, our lands have been destroyed by the IMC, forcefully taking our resources, polluting and destroying our planets, and killing us off if we try to resist. Despite recent victories at Demeter and beyond, we have a long way to go before the IMC is defeated. Now, I serve as a rifleman in the militia, fighting to free the frontier. I'm a long way from becoming a pilot. But when that day comes, I hope I can live up to the honor. Here we go, Rifleman Cooper. Oh, hell. Ship must have power cycled the Simpod since last time. We'll have to recalibrate it. Running lifeboat diagnostic test 2.1. All Mark 8 lifeboats. Does that feel right to you, Cooper? All right, we're good to go. Let's see how much you remember from last time. Setting the neural link. Not quite the same as a Titan Link, but it's similar. To learn new skills, we need to be in the right state of mind. Ah, much better. Technically, I'm not supposed to be training you, but in you I see potential. Besides, we're at war. Who's got time for classes, eh? Here you go, up and over. Let's pick up the pace, enabling jump kit assist. Jump kits operate on the principle of relaxed stability. Once your jump kit calibrates to your movement style, enhanced mobility becomes second nature. Beautiful, isn't it? It's inspired by my home planet of Harmony. This is where I grew up. This is what we're fighting for, Cooper. A world that's not metal and smoke. Let's make sure your jump kit is primed. Basic wall run here. Give it a try. Good. Now you're moving. Under here. Stay low. Simple double jump. Follow the ghost. We've retaken over a quarter of frontier space since the Battle of Demeter. Militia's better organized now. More people join every day to fight the IMC. People like you. We used to just run and hide from them. 
But now, we chase them. In combat, things never go as you expect. You must be ready to use any weapon you can find on the field. These are just a few of the weapons I've come across out there. Time to hit the range. Load your weapon. Use a different weapon this time. Grab another one off the rack. Good. Grab some more if you want, then head to the gauntlet. Violets have to strike a balance in combat. Speed is paramount, but you must also hit your targets. The gauntlet is where we practice those skills, until they're second nature. something special to show you. with the gauntlet I'm ready to see what's next good you're gonna like this it's time you learn the other half of being a pilot the Titan let's go call one in now, aren't pilots the only ones allowed to do that it's only a simulation rifleman it's not the real thing but first we're gonna need a little more space That's my partner, BT. 
is a Vanguard class. Homegrown militia technology. First Titan chassis we designed ourselves. One we didn't have to steal from the IMC. Go ahead, Rifleman. Go on your first Titan. Look up to the sky. There he is. All right, Rifleman. Sounds like it's about to hit the fan. I'm pulling you out. Powering down all known essential systems. Cooper, ready up. Easy, Cole. You just left VR. He needs a minute to decompress. He'll be ready to go. Trust me. Yes, sir. It's up. They're killing us. Trying to, anyway. Good session in there. You'll get the hang of it someday. We'll make a pilot out of you yet, Rifleman. But not today. No time. Last of most, huh? Anderson? You son of a bitch. See you down there. We're gonna see a new planet today. Maybe even die on it. See you down there, Rifleman. Good luck. Get your ass out of the Simpod, Cooper. Meet at the dropship. Bad shape. Hold on. This might knock you out, but you should be okay when you wake up. 
Blastomosa. Hostile Titans inbound. Apex Predators. Copy that, BT. Mercenaries. Stay down, Koopa. BT, let's go! We have 18 hours. 18 hours until the Ark is sealed and ready for delivery. Oi, Rika! Leave the corpses alone, you sick bastard. We've got a job to do, eh? We make corpses, we don't clean them up. Let's go! Transfer authorization to new pilot, Link, Bra <coughs> Bravo Tango, 7274. Cooper, take my Titan. Use my helmet and my jump kit. This is the real thing. Take care of him.
should be in transferred for recasing. Tech has a new shell design. This was no less than four regiments during that violation. Grenadiers to any militia survivors. We are relocating to the IMC beacon at map grid 772981. Anyone copy? This is Sergeant Ezel from the 2nd Militia Fusiliers. We read your call. We're going to make our way over to you through the reclamation facility. Over. Copy that. Keep your heads up. Go out. <laughs> Intruders, this is General Marder of the Interstellar Manufacturing Corporation. We work for the IMC, not this or his messenger. We work for whoever the IMC say we What are you trying to get? Metal? I don't care who's giving you orders. Blisk and it works, General Marder. Us grunts get paid the same either way. All that matters is if that thing in the mountains goes online as scheduled. I think it's true. The techs are saying about it. Do I look like a bloody animal to you? But if it isn't true, then the militia are gonna have a very bad
Vanguard class Titan. These things are rare. We should sell it. No bloody way. Those weren't blessed orders. That guy doesn't. He got me fresh! Power low. Insufficient power. Power at two thirds. Data core reinitialized. Ocular system online. Adjusting focus. Are you all right, pilot? I think so. Wait, did you just call me pilot? Yes. The late Captain Lastimosa gave you the provisional rank of acting pilot. Congratulations on your promotion. You may call me BT. BT. Got it. My systems are rebooting, but a third battery will accelerate the process. I will remain here. Until I am mobile, I will assist you through your helmet radio when possible. To all militia personnel, the IMC will grant safe passage back to the Angel City Penitentiary. To all who surrender, you would be wise to turn yourselves in to any IMC search teams immediately. Eyes against turning yourself over to the IMC. Voice pattern analysis indicates they are lying. But don't worry, BT. I'm not going anywhere. Understood, but I do recommend you move. IMC salvage teams are not far away. I mean I'm not leaving. It is a common requirement for pilots to maneuver in situations without a linked Titan. Shelf mercenaries, invitation only. I'm surprised you've never heard of it. What about Geek? Maybe I'll become a mercenary. Pilot, my mapping systems have been restored. The ambush of the 9th Militia Fleet has landed us far off course from our original destination. We are located in hostile territory. Be careful, we cannot stay here long. How long did you serve with Lastimosa? Captain Lastimosa linked with me 973 days ago. Sorry. You guys must have been close. He was an excellent pilot. And a good friend.
Who is this voice? This is the commander of the Marauder Corps, a section of the Malicious Special Recon Squadron, or SRS. Her name is Sarah Briggs. BT, is there anyone alive on this ship? No. Scans do not detect any life signs within the MCS James McAllen, but 90% of the lifeboats have been ejected. There is still hope. Pilot, our location has been compromised.
Phantoms are IMC scouts. Enemy reinforcements will be on their way. We must complete the Neuralink immediately. Please install the final battery. Power at full capacity. We must establish a neural link in order to proceed. Please embark when ready. <sighs> Protocol one, link to pilot. Establishing neural link. Neuralink established. Rifleman Jack Cooper, you are now confirmed as acting pilot of BT-7274. Protocol 2, uphold the mission. Our orders are to resume Special Operation 217. Rendezvous with Major Anderson of the SRS. I'm detecting incoming enemy forces. Protocol 3, protect the pilot. Reinitializing critical systems. Vortex Shield Online. The Vortex Shield catches incoming rounds and missiles. Release the button to launch any captured objects back at the enemy. Pilot, the Acolyte Pod is online. This shoulder-mounted rocket pod will lock onto multiple enemy targets. The longer you hold down the button, the more locks you achieve. Neuralink complete. Primary weapon control and motion link re-established. Pilot, enemy Titanfall detected. We will have to fight our way to safety. Get ready. You sure about this? Yes, trust me. Let's find spotted chassis number BT-7274. rating has increased. Pilot, I detect more IMC salvage teams on the way. Our only chance of survival is to uphold our mission of rendezvousing with Major Anderson. Until then, you and I are on our own. Marking your HUD. We must move quickly. Pilot, the IMC will continue to search for us. Our only chance of survival is to rendezvous with Major Anderson 60 clicks from our current location. We will have to improvise and adapt if we wish to survive. This is fallbound 3-2. We're taking heavy casualties down here. Any military forces, please assist. We're stuck with heavy losses. Problem? 
design and may give us a tactical advantage great a new titan weapon will be useful agreed the imc is well equipped with advanced titan weaponry they will be most beneficial to our success pilot with the tone loadout we can lock onto enemies and target them with tracking rockets this will be useful in direct combat Oh, my God. 
Sonar pulse activated. Wait, now filtering. Automated testing facility. Dome one. override engaged opening flow regulation gate warning toxic fumes dispersing in the main chamber activating control room safety airlock procedures pilot the safety airlock has sealed you in the control room you must find another way out we have no choice but to split up got it i'll find a way out a nearby exit will most likely lead further into the reclamation facility Pilot, I am tracking your location. Recommend you seek an exit. You got it, BT. You do the same. Copy that, Pilot. Here, my IMC and militia friends, is a failure to communicate. And that's okay. That's okay. That's all good. That guy doesn't sound stable. Agreed. Scans indicate the source is somewhere in this facility. We should not waste time here. Switching most of the KO he kills. We got four something. Check your angle. Plenty militia left in the facility, just so you know, this is Kane's place. You're welcome to stay as long as it takes to kill you, which, by the way, not be long. Sir, our squad has taken a beating. They can use some help up ahead.
I feel like we've been walking for days. Do you require rest? No. Good. There is no time for rest. We must uphold the mission. One more day! Hostile pilot! Everyone tighten up! Target lost! Lost on target. Pilot, down below. I can't get a bloody shot. Target outside. Anyone have eyes? Negative, no visual. 10 0. SRS pilot taking out my iron Whoever you are. Not bad. Not bad at all, my friend. I just hope you're better than the last one I killed.
exercise caution. You can say that again. Pilot, exercise caution. Sounds good. Scans indicate multiple IMC security forces. Prepare yourself, pilot. Long time no see, BT. On the contrary, your helmet provided me with a live feed of your actions. You fought well out there, pilot. The controls to deactivate the sludge flow are in the next chamber, marking your HUD. Activate the sludge flows in order to regroup. I have marked the controls on your HUD. Overriding pump filter system. Emergency shutdown initiated. Pump shutdown sequence at 20%. Sludge balls contain a high concentration of heavy metals. They are interfering with my targeting systems. How hard can it be to shoot? Blind firing into my pilot's combat zone would be a violation of Protocol 3. at 40 percent.
Special Operation 217. Rendezvous with Major Anderson of the SRS. You were not invited to Kane's party. And that's why you're dead. <laughs> Well, well. Another runaway hero. With an SRS Vanguard class Titan. Woo! Now we're talking! <laughs> Bring it a knife to a knife fight. Let's get this party started, Trump. Salvo for ready. Pilot, stay out of here. enemy communications has a strong history in warfare. This will work to our advantage. In order to survive, we must keep moving. Major Anderson went this way. It could be a shortcut to the rendezvous point. I recommend we proceed. Pilot control initiated. Watch our step. What is this place? Accessing files. Unknown. What are we doing here, BT? We must proceed through this facility. Point with Major Anderson. It is our only chance of survival. Copy your last eyes on. He's in a 
crash site headed south. Over. Solid copy. If you reacquire, try to contact SRS. Ask for Commander Sarah Briggs. Sharp 2-6 out. Ash, this is Blisk. A copy over. This is Ash. Go ahead. Gain is not responding. I think our militia pilot's trying to be a hero. He's got to be headed your way. Kill him. Understood. Ash out. Who's Blisk? He is a war criminal, wanted by the militia, commonly employed by the IMC. Blisk was responsible for the death of my previous pilot, Captain Lastimosa. Engaging 
hostile Titan. Loading docks cargo lift offers a shortcut through the facility. Check your HUD for the control panel. Good idea. Thank you, pilot. Thank you. 
Cooper. If you read me, I'm being taken to this facility substation. BT, how do I get to you? You must follow the pipes to the lower levels. Warning, losing contact.
structures. We are not far apart. Keep moving. What the hell are they building here, BT? Unknown, but I doubt the IMC are mass producing homes. They usually destroy them.
Grinder. You okay? I'm undamaged. However, I do not believe this is a food processing plant. In my luck, this place is gonna turn itself inside out. Or upside down, considering the circumstances.
Ground scenario activated. Resetting terrain. Impressive pilot. You made it all the way alive. Unfortunately, you there is only one way out. Loading scenario 127 in Dynamic Simulation Dome 314. Now, we shall see how impressive you truly are. Delivering militia test subjects. Another test! Arm up! I barely survived the last one! Shut up and grab a gun! Look! Pilot! I'll be favor. Nothing about this is in our favor! Aim sharp! Scenario 127, load complete. Let us begin. Deploying sectors. is accelerating. Are you in distress? You could say that. Your heart rate is exceeding 170 beats per minute. If possible, you should find a place to rest. Yeah, I'll get right on it. Initiating IMC reboot test program.
Still breathing. You? Still operational, but unable to escape. I have detected an opening in the outer wall. You should get out of there while you can. Marking your HUD. Silent field and vision loss. As I should have expected, the IMC infantry clearly lack your resolve. Perhaps I have no choice but to step in personally. Rare miscalculation on my part. Tell me you killed that pilot. I am dealing with him. Stop getting caught up in your games. Am I not allowed to enjoy myself while I work? Not when your work suffers. Point taken. Ash out. Don't worry. With the price I'm putting on his head, you can buy all the toys you want. Sector 4 Charlie. Detonate charges 21 through 29. To all IMC personnel, this is Ash. I am sorry to report, due to your inability to contain the security breach, I have been forced to scuttle the entire complex. Some of you may consider this overkill. It is. I suggest you evacuate immediately. Restocking Prowler Containment. series of explosions just weakened the manipulator arm. I have broken free. This place is falling apart. I suggest we leave. You are not far from my location. Marking your HUD.
just to embark pilot.
security lockdown disengaged. Surface access is authorized. Pilot, the security lockdown has been disengaged. I recommend we leave through the tunnel. further shortcuts. Pilot, Major Anderson is here. Investigate this facility. I will meet you on the other side. Don't get captured again, BT. I will avoid all shortcuts. Overseer requests all teams working on the ARC analysis report to the lecture hall for General Marder's presentation. What just happened? There are distortions throughout this facility, and they appear to be causing a rift in time. I advise caution until we have further information. By decisively neutralizing the militia forces, we will in fact safeguard the existence of the human race. Yes, pilot. But lest we lose sight of the bigger picture, Remember, those losses are ultimately replaceable by the inexorable march of human reproduction. By decisively neutralizing the militia forces, we will in fact safeguard the existence of the human race. Ex yes, pilot, may I help you? Is this place the IMC has multiple scientific research facilities throughout the frontier however this particular one is unlike any known to the militia how so the large rings within the main campus are not an IMC technology its design is foreign and its function is unknown strange up traces of my own data signature within this area. The distortions must be affecting my scans. Interesting. I'm detecting traces of a massive energy explosion throughout this facility. However, your helmet data does not detect the same in the other timeline. None of these remains match the genetic profile of Major Anderson. He may still be alive. 
I recommend you check the main lobby of reception. I would accompany you, but unfortunately my chassis will not fit through the door. Oh, lucky you. I detect sarcasm. Signature on the upper level of the reception lobby. Recommend you investigate. The trial run of the Ark will continue as planned, but you have to get security to evacuate all Tier 1 personnel. General Marder and his key team members are transferring to remote observation. I found Anderson. He's, uh, in the ceiling. Objective complete. We have rendezvoused with Major Anderson. That's cold, BT. Correct. Anderson's current temperature is 17 degrees Celsius, below the threshold of human survival. Pilot, if you hand me Anderson's helmet, I will analyze it. With the death of Anderson, command of Special Operation 217 now transfers to you. Congratulations on your field promotion, Pilot Cooper. The following is Anderson's mission briefing from Commander Sarah Briggs of the Militia SRS. Major Anderson, two weeks ago we intercepted IMC comms. They found something on Typhon. A massive blast of energy was discharged at this location, creating time distortions. I want SRS on the ground to infiltrate the facility. Roger that. I'll get some answers. This wrist-mounted device we recovered during Operation Grizzly should protect you. We know the IMC have contracted Kuban Blisk and his mercenaries to protect something critical there. So watch your back. And Anderson, you know how much I love writing death reports, so don't go it alone. The SRS is a team. Pilot, the data Major Anderson collected appears to be incomplete. We are duty-bound to uphold and fulfill Special Operation 217. Recommend we locate Anderson's wrist-mounted device before proceeding. I didn't see any device on Anderson. It must be on the other half of his corpse. I detect a breach in the security services building. I will provide access. I will remain here and scan the ring structure while you investigate the facility for intel and the missing device. Nice. Maybe next time you can throw me. Noted.
advanced cloaking package. Copy that. Laser meshes are online. Sending a team to investigate. Dr. Alexander Darren, log 14.6. The intruder has some kind of advanced tech and is slaughtering our response teams. Tyler and Wildlife Research said two teams were taken out of the elevator banks in a matter of seconds. By one guy. Sorry, Anderson. some of my AI functions into your helmet in order to prevent communication across time shifts.
position. found something all right. It can fold space and time. They sure as hell didn't build it, but they're restoring it. Whatever they're planning, it's potentially catastrophic. Anderson out.
Anderson's log 342. The fold weapons power source is called the Ark. Doesn't look like they've perfected the casing. This one's empty. The Ark must be somewhere else. Anderson out. Dr. Ehrenberg, log 11.4. Further research still leaves questions about the fold weapon and its intended purpose. I don't think we're using it right, and that may cause a problem. Harder. Well, I'm going on record. This is a bad idea. Dr. Jefferson Boyle, log one. Looks like they went forward with the ARC test, despite my warnings to postpone, but what Martyr wants, Martyr gets. I don't know how I survived, but I did. For now. I've tried all the exits, but I'm trapped. Damn place is locked down good. All I have is hope. That's what I get for picking a lab underground. What can I say? I like archaeology.
specimen 3.4. The experiments on the IMS Odyssey's colonists are underway. Soon we will discover the long-lasting effects the Ark has on organic matter and brain function.
Anderson's plan indicated a recon mission within close proximity to the center of the active rings. You want me to do what? If we can obtain the Ark's energy signature, the militia fleet will be able to track its current location in the present day. Dr. Jefferson Boyle, log two. I found myself a standard IMC survival kit, which provides me with enough flavorless rations to keep me alive for a few days. I'm hoping that's all I need. Otherwise, I'm gonna have to get creative. I hate getting creative. moon is a test. This damn thing was just a test. One of our own planets is next. They're going to hit Harmony. And they've moved up the timeline. I have to get this intel to Sarah. Hold it right there, pilot. Okay. <laughs> final recording. Cooper, based on your recon of this facility, I may have a plan. Meet me outside. I would like to spend some time today to talk about the value of human life. There is no value to human life. Now that I have your attention, to be more precise, human life to a certain limit is expendable. We are self-perpetuating, yet self-destructive, adaptable, yet flawed, and always, always resource-intensive. We are endless consumers of resources. But most relevant to our research here is one undeniable fact, that human life is abundant. Overpopulation of any colonized world is a given. Through the lens of cold objectivity, it is irresponsible to say that all individuals on such worlds are actually indispensable. Millions of humans die across the colonized world every day by any number of causes. Human life is expendable. Now our problem is twofold. On the one hand, we are faced with a hostile frontier populace opposed to our commercial pursuits for the greater good. And on the other hand, there is a never-ending cry for natural resources, demanded of us by the greater populations of the core systems. We must have order on the frontier if we are to achieve true progress, but the militia, in its provincial myopic lack of vision, refuses to accept this. Thus, we are at war. Now the bitter truth. Reinforcements from the core systems will not arrive for several more years. The militia gains strength day by day, taking back one planet after another. Our choices are limited. Drastic action must be taken. Again, I remind you all of one simple truth. That human life is abundant. And, as distasteful as it may sound, Human life is, in truth, expendable. 
And so that brings us to this planet Typhon, where we have discovered a gift, a machine that can do more than change the tide. Call it fate, call it evolution, call it what you will. The truth is we have discovered our resolution, and in it lies a weapon with a powerful ability to fold space and time. We don't know who built it, but we do know that it is quite old. And most importantly, we have learned enough to bring it to life. As we use this fold weapon, we will manipulate space-time targeting anything we desire, sundering entire planets. Our restoration efforts in the mountains are nearly complete, but one task remains. We must complete a small-scale test here first, to tune the power source for the arc as our colleagues tend to call it. Once we have accomplished this, we will transfer the power source, the Ark, to the full-scale site and destroy one populated militia planet and then another until they capitulate. We will open an Einstein-Rosen bridge sending through thousands of concentrated gravitational waves. This will rip apart and sunder every molecule, every atom and every living thing we target, resulting in total loss of life. But lest we lose sight of the bigger picture, remember those losses are ultimately replaceable by the inexorable march of human reproduction. By decisively neutralizing the militia forces, we will in fact safeguard the existence of the human race, extending its reach and power towards a prosperous and bright future. I'd like to spend some time today to talk about the value of human life. There is no value. Target all non IMC military subjects. I recommend you meet me at the rings in order to scan the Ark's energy signature.
I have located the controls to extend the bridge to the rings. I have marked it on your HUD. Activating sonar pulse. It appears that whatever actions you took in the past have caused the remaining automated security systems to be quite hostile towards us in the present. Transferring controls to pilot.
try to get as close as possible to the center of the rings. As Anderson discovered, the IMC intend to destroy the militia planet of Harmony using the full-scale version of this weapon. Pilot Cooper, our journey is far from over. We must get this data to the fleet. Get over there in time. Forty million souls on the planet Harmony will be lost. We must get this information to SRS Commander Sarah Briggs. Pilot, I see the beacon up ahead. Scans detect minimal power functionality. It may need repairs. Caution. I'm picking up multiple contacts. Hostiles confirmed. The stalkers appear to be programmed to attack the control room. detect traces of poisonous chemicals within the fog. I can handle it. Unlikely, pilot. The fog is deadly to organic life. We cannot uphold the mission if you are dead. You will be safe in the cockpit. Transferring controls to pilot. Inside that beacon control room. 
They are signaling distress. Patching in. Direct contact with the militia riflemen. Practical option. Run them over. My 40 ton chassis can eliminate smaller enemies. tried. Sensors indicate another one in the substation, but it's nearly impossible to get down there. This place just ain't built for humans. Understood. Pilot Cooper, I advise caution while navigating this facility substation. You must recover the arc tool. Good luck, sir. Hope you make it back. We've lost too many down there. Taking out Demeter was a huge victory for us. Why doesn't it feel that way? Well, the Demeter fleet was only about a third of the IMC presence on the frontier. Still, every little victory counts. You have the fullest half glass I've ever seen. Blisk and his mercs are cold-blooded killers. It's a good thing someone's been picking them off one by one. I heard someone's been killing off Blisk's team, giving the mercenaries a taste of their own medicine. We were just forced to watch the massacre over at the Beacon. Nothing I could do but watch. Pilot. The Beacon Power substation is through that door marked Power Grid. Good luck, pilot. That pilot's got to know some interesting tactics. Marvin Delta 73 Zulu, please report to Sector Bravo 7. Pilot, more stalkers are expected. We'll hold them off, but don't be gone too long. We should just seal this place off and be done with it. Yeah, that's your answer to everything, Mary. This place is run by machines. There's an elevator around here. How are we gonna get through this? We're getting low on ammo. And soldiers. I wonder how deep this facility goes. down here. It's great to have a pilot with us again. Looks like we'll have a chance of getting out after all. I wish I could tell you what's down there, but whatever it is, we're hoping you can handle the pilot. The last pilot in our unit went that way a few hours ago, but he never came back. Be careful. Pilot, I have patched into your helmet display to monitor your progress. The channel is open if you need assistance. BT, remind me what I'm doing here. Your mission is to obtain an arc tool. Using it, we can jumpstart the power systems and get the beacon back online. Scans detect its signature further within this facility substation. Got it. BT, what's up with these walls? 
Scanning. Exposed power circuits. You should avoid physical contact. Proceed forward with caution. Deep as they go. Scans reveal a maximum depth of 300 meters. What is this place? The station's computer details this location as the power grid for an IMC interstellar beacon.
successful. The fan exhaust is offline. Do not be afraid. The jump kit can take that fall.
That was impressive, pilot. They're waiting for you back in the control room. He's got the arc tool. Now that's impressive. Power to get the beat. Back and that looks like an arc tool to me. I think we just got our ticket off this dirt ball. Good work, Pilot Cooper. Now we can jumpstart the power to get the beacon functional. The cable is secure, Captain. Glad you made it back, Cooper. Just in time, too. The system's rewired. Now all we need is some power. Pilot, the power chamber relays are offline. The arc tool should be able to jumpstart them manually. Cooper, let's hope that arc tool was worth all the trouble. High radiation levels detected ahead. Your suit will only protect you for a limited time inside the chamber. I suggest you move quickly. I wouldn't stay in there too long unless you want to be burnt to a crisp. Okay, opening the hatch in three, two, one, go! Diagnostic complete. Power 100%. Initiate dish targeting reset. Uplink targeting module. Reset initiated. 60%. 70%. 80 80%. 90%. Warning. Fault detected. Emergency shutdown. What's going on? Talk to me. Not sure. Some sort of failsafe. Captain, the uplink targeting module is offline. Not good. That the IMC are on their way. That is a reasonable assumption. McCord, can we bypass the module? No, sir. Not unless we want to send a message to the entire IMC fleet. Then the module's gonna have to be repaired manually. Pilot, this situation could use your skills. I hope you're up for another trip to hell, Cooper. You'll need to repair the beacon on site and get back here as fast as possible. Controls transferred to pilot. soldiers over there. Scans indicate a fallen pilot. My memory recalls this pilot as an exceptional fighter, proven well during the fracture operation. What's fracture? Fracture was the code name of a major combat refueling operation conducted by the militia on the planet Victor. We sustained many casualties, but the fleet survived. Damn. My scans detect a functioning uplink targeting module, 428 meters northeast. My analysis indicates a throw is our only option here. I can throw you across the gap. That's insane. Wind, three knots, heading 274. Range, 95 meters. Projectile mass, 
89 kilograms. Trust me. I think I'm going to need some new underpants. Copy that. Noted for the next supply drop. Richter, this is Blisk. Yeah, here's Richter. That damn pilot is trying to use the beacon. End this. I'm counting on you. Blisk out. Security units, this is Richter. Get to the beacon now. Find the kleiner Mann and lass mich nicht hängen. Copy that. Zulu 1 Kilo 1, move in. Alpha 2, get soldiers on ground. Move it! IMC dropships headed to your location.
Baseline, watch your eyes. Diverting forces to assist. ETA, three minutes.
1-4. Hostile pilot sighted. Headed your way. Acknowledge. Kilo 1-4, do you copy? Come in, Kilo 1-4. All units, Kilo 1-4 is not responding. Prepare to engage the target at Beacon 4. Copy that. Position at Beacon 4 gantry. Standing by to intercept. Targeting module detected. Check your HUD. Luton 1 6, Beacon 4 gantry team is KIA. Pilot may be attempting to transmit from there. Zulu 1 6, Director. The pilot's intentions are unknown. He may be attempting to draw us away from the Titan. 9, focus on the pilot. I have other plans for the Titan. Give me a sit -trap. Over. Richter, we need backup. The enemy pilot is still active around Beacon 4. Over. Backup? Typische IMC Schwachkopf. Sending backup.
The module is in the projector of that dish. Titan squads have arrived, requesting assistance. Hostile infantry. Secure this area before proceeding with the repairs. Stalker down. It holds transfer to Titan. Excessive damage. Warning. Warning. Good shot.
Are you okay, pilot? Barely. That was tough. How are you, PT? Damage report. Critical systems are functioning properly. And despite your self-evaluation, I'm certain Captain Lastimosa would have said you fought well, Cooper. Thanks. Protocol 2, mission update. Replace the uplink module. The socket for the module is at the top of this dish. A throw combined with additional climbing is required. This is Sloan. Go ahead. Kane and Ash are dead. Someone's been killing your mercs, and it looks like one of our radios has been nicked. I knew you shouldn't have hired those tossers. <laughs> Oi, pilot. This is Cuban Blisk. You've been listening to us, eh? You want to be a hero, yeah? Okay. Keep coming at me. Keep coming. But if I were you, I'd stop trying so hard to be a hero. You'll live longer. The dish will automatically reorient itself once the new module is installed. Intercept and destroy their pilot, then execute the remaining militia troops. Reapers inbound. Militia forces, lock down the control room. Threats detected. Copy that. Locking down. We will assist from here.
hostile Titan. I am Sheik Brown Squads. I'm looking for someone to promote. I'm also looking for someone to kill. You get to choose which one you wish to be. Und jetzt mach ihn fertig. Militia Titan spotted chassis number BT-7. Not let him leave here alive. Fight. Let's see what you got up close and personal. Who the best of that life, me and Kleiner Junge? This is BT-7274. Protocol 2, uphold the mission. Report intel to the fleet attached to the SRS unit. Solid copy. Good to hear you guys are still down there. We're receiving your data now. BT-7274, your data recorder says your original pilot was KIA. Correct. Captain Ty Lastimosa was killed in action. I am now linked to an acting pilot, Rifleman Jack Cooper. Wait a minute. Lastimosa linked you to a rifleman? Yes. He had no other options. Understood. We'll get you transferred to a fully qualified pilot. Objection. Cooper is my pilot. Our combat effectiveness rating now exceeds 90%. Request permission to retain this link. You're lucky our backs are up against the wall, BT. Permission granted. That's high praise coming from a machine, Cooper. Thanks to your scan data of the Ark, we've tracked its energy signature to an IMC base right here on Typhon. We don't have much time. Let's go.
Before. Not exactly. There are significantly more variables to throwing between two moving platforms. Good luck.
in sight. Cooper, stand by. The 6-4 are coming aboard. There are still anti-air cannons active on the deck of the Malta. They must be disabled from the bridge before we can approach. We're on it. Nice work, Coop. Good covering fire. We got your back. Commander Briggs, we'll also need your help. Copy that, Bear. On my way. The bridge is through that hangar over there. Any ideas? Briggs here. What do you need me to do? Close the door and keep her steady. He's not thinking. Oh, no. Wait a sec. Follow me. Oh, I love this oh, joke. Well, it's never boring. Move your ass, Davis. Repeat. Both red. All security forces converge on the hangar left. for control for pilot. Cooper will cover you from the rear. Take the deck and get to the Draconis. Buddha One, Viper's on station. Your journey ends here, pilot. The skies belong to me. Nowhere to run. Nowhere to hide. Tally, engaging bandit.
going down. Mayday, Mayday, going down. Commander Briggs, this is BT-7274. Viper is down. Copy that. Board the Draconis and secure the Ark. We'll prep for transfer. Cooper, ready for fastball. for wind resistance. Calculating. More hard right! ah! to carry. We must improvise. Lisk, your problems are not my concern. Once you have delivered the Ark as per your contract, your payment will be transferred by the IMC. Just have my money ready. I'll get you, you precious cargo, you useless nev. Oi, Titan! You're gonna open up and give me what I want. Voice command. Not recognized. Let me just rip it out of him. Can't risk it. The Ark's unstable. Listen, hero. You have what's mine, and I want it back. Go on. Tell your Titan to open up. BT, open that hatch when this guy's dead. <sighs> Still trying to be a hero, eh? I have a lot of dosh riding on this contract, my friend. So tell your Titan, if he doesn't open up, I will shoot you in the head. Pilot in jeopardy. Ocular systems. Marginal. Cannot visually acquire pilot. Stand him up. Do you see him now? Right here. Right here. 
Yeah? You see him now? Functions compromised by severe crash damage. I don't care how broken you are. I know deep down, some things, some things still work in there. Now open up. I'm going to shoot your pilot in the head. You still remember numbers, don't you? I'm going to count to three. One. Two. Three. Nah, that wasn't so hard, was it? That's the problem with teams. If you don't win together, you die together.
Hello, Jack. Glad to have you back in one piece, BT. Over 25,000, actually. BT-7274 online and ready for combat. It is time to complete our mission. Close. That's nice. 
lethal weapon at all costs. If we fail, the militia planet of Harmony will be destroyed. Attention IMC personnel, this is General Mardo. The mercenaries have delivered the Ark. Prep the fold weapon. Initiating preliminary fold weapon power systems. Powering up targeting responders. Set location to the militia planet Harmony. Initiating targeting systems. Harmony, coordinates 264.588 recorded. Transferring controls to pilot. You have your money, Bliss. Now go. My forces will take over from here. That time they do something. I think our militia pilot's trying to be a hero. He's all yours. Keep the salvage. Who said anything about salvage? I'll do this one for free. You know what I see when I look at you? The pilot needs money. Planetary designation, Harmony. Stage three, calculating space fold projection. Sorry, mate. I'm not die. Come 
on. Let's do this, you little fuck. Lucky day, hero. I'm not going to kill you. I don't work for free. But you don't get to kill me either. Yeah, you earned this, eh? Listen, that Vanguard class Titan is still in there. Not my problem, Marta. Should have put it in my contract. I've got other people with money to see. This one, VT. Calculating. Protocol 3. Protect the pilot. VT, what are you doing? Trust me. VT!
Tyler Cooper. A lot of people owe their lives to you. And to BT. Barker, set a course for Harmony. Take us home. You got it. The destruction of Typhon saved the planet Harmony. The militia calls this planet their headquarters. But millions of others call it home. Commander Briggs says I'll be inducted into the Marauder Corps and assigned a new Titan. After the techs wipe what's left of my neural link with BT. I don't know what that'll feel like to get assigned a new Titan. But I kind of like the old one. This is Pilot Jack Cooper, signing off.